Okay, I just want to take you through some bits and pieces I've got for sale in the shop. Um, if you remember that van and the walnut cabinets that they've got on it, I'm replicating those, which I'm just built some at the moment. That's set up for a CR50 fridge there. Uh, you can put a door on it if you want, if you don't want to put that fridge. Uh, it's not quite finished yet. I'm in the process, but you can see basically it's going to be the same as uh, the van behind me. And I just want to show you, I don't use chop blocks like everybody else. Mine are all, uh, all my furniture is done properly basically, it's not a bodge. I don't use bodge blocks. I use pocket holes from a pocket hole jig so they're all screwed in tight and I use mortise and tenons like it should be done and they're all glued and then screwed to hold in place. As you can see there, I've just taken that apart for you. There you go, mortise and tenon. Everything, the whole cupboard, everything is built like that. You see, if I quickly spin right around there now, as it is, I've not done any um, pocket holes for the pocket hole screws, but you look around, there's not one fixing showing. Nothing at all is on display how it's fixed together. I mean, this, this piece and that piece aren't fixed together, but that's a separate unit. Obviously, you can see I'm just holding it in place with that clamp. And that's a separate unit. So you've got three separate units at the moment, but not one. The only fixings, as you can see, for the plastic extrusions that I use. Again, nothing. No chop blocks. So it's obviously a thousand times stronger than plastic. And they're made to order, any colour you want. I just like walnut. Uh, you've got a carbon fibre, you can go for a carbon fibre type finish there, if you can make that out. Carbon fibre board, you've got the walnut board. Black gloss. As you can see it's actually got a plastic coating on it at the moment, but you take that off when you're finished. Um, I'm not sure what that one is. We've got a Pantella, which I tend to use for the worktops, which is that. And yeah, that's all available. Um, if not on the site yet, then just contact me if you want anything. Each unit costs about 900, 950 to 1,000 pound. It depends exactly what you want, really. Um, obviously, it's more if you want to put your um, your cookers in, your hob, etc. Whack them in for you, and it's going to be a bit more. And, uh, and at the moment, I'm putting tambour doors on these, so you can still open the door when the bed's up. So they're going to come with those. A little bit extra. Cheers. Thanks for watching.